So today we're going to spend a little bit of time talking about our new Velcro tail bags. There's been several questions on the best way to use them. So we're just gonna go over that really quickly. I already braided his tail so that we can move quickly through this. But the gist of it is that you want to make sure that your horse's tail is well conditioned and brushed out before you braid it. It's important to start your braid a few inches below their tailbone because you don't want the hair underneath their tailbone to be tight or pulling. There's a lot of nerves in their tailbone and we just don't want that to be uncomfortable for them or to cause any issues. So we start about two or three inches below and then we start with a looser braid here at the top and then tighten the braid up as we go down. I like to use a stronger hair tie than the normal mane and tail hair bands because I like the durability, but that's up to you. And then you basically just fold your tail up like this. You open up the tail bag with the Velcro strap here. And then, oh, getting stuck, strong Velcro. <laughs> and then you go ahead and just put the tail through the top. It goes in there easily. And then you take this back strap from the back side of the tail bag and bring it through the loose part of the braid at the top of their braid. Oh. And then you take that strap, line it up good with this Velcro piece right here, and then close it up with the other Velcro piece. And then you have your tail bag nice and secure and your horse's tail is going to be clean and protected.